We're here today with Dr. Rosanna Salvatera from Peterborough Public Health. Good morning. Good morning. Happy to be here in the outdoors with you. Uh, we're here to talk a little bit about Lyme disease. Uh, there's been a new provincial action plan announced, and uh, maybe you can tell us a little bit about Lyme disease. What exactly is it? Sure. Uh, Lyme disease is an infection, and it's transmitted to humans through the bite of a tick. Uh, ticks are uh, related to, sp to spiders. They're very small. Probably uh, many people can't even see them uh, before they feed. But they uh, attach to the human body. They feed for about three to seven days. Uh, and they can transmit the bacteria that causes Lyme disease once they've been attached for at least 24 hours. Okay. Yeah. And so I guess one of the main messages is uh, prevention and being uh, avoiding being bitten by a tick. Well, yes. Avoiding the tick bite is most important. Now, there are parts of the province where the black-legged ticks are endemic, and that's typically around the northern shores of Lake Erie, Lake Ontario, and the St. Lawrence River. Uh, but because these black-legged ticks can be hitchhikers and hitch rides on migratory birds or even on deer, uh, there is a low risk of acquiring uh, Lyme disease throughout Ontario. And in fact, in 2015, we had 400 reported oh. cases of Lyme disease in humans. And it seems that this trend is increasing. Climate change is certainly going to contribute to an increasing risk of acquiring Lyme disease. So yes, prevention is the best uh, the best way to address it. Right, so there's a, there's a possibility you might get Lyme disease, or you might encounter ticks anywhere in the yes. province. So how can one avoid uh, getting bitten, and what, what are some tips? Well, first of all, go you know don't stay inside. Sure. I mean, I think everyone needs to be outside. It's good for us. It's good to be active. Ticks live in wooded areas in grassland. They crawl up and they wait for the human to go by to attach. So first thing, you know, wear long pants, clothes, shoes, and socks, long sleeves, and tuck them in to your tuck your pants into your socks, uh, and then give yourself a good spray with Beak. That'll help repel the ticks so they don't attach. Light colored clothing, you can see the ticks. And really do an inspection once a day. You know, have a shower at the end of the day if you've been outdoors and look for those ticks. Use a mirror if you can't see the back. Look in the private spot. And if you find a tick, detach it. Just take some tweezers, grab the head, straight out, lift it out, put it in a, a jar like this and bring it to your local public health unit. Okay. We can test the tick to see if it's black-legged ticks. They're the only ones that do transmit Lyme. Right. We can actually test it for Lyme disease. And, uh, and certainly your uh, physicians now uh, can uh, diagnose Lyme disease early, uh, can do the testing, and can treat it so that you uh, can, can have uh, you know, a good recovery. Oh, well, excellent. So that's uh, recognized now. It's uh, treatable, and there's lots of good prevention tips. So. Yeah. That's great. Well, it's great information about Lyme disease and about being safe in the outdoors. So thanks for your for your help today. My pleasure.